G'day guys, how you going? Um, today I'm going to show you a little um, a little unit that you can get for your domino to do um, small job. Now this is a little small job, it's only about 200 wide by about 80 high. And it, what it is, it's a little spice rack system. I'm just putting in my daughter's cupboards in her kitchen which I'm making. But, but this is only just a little sample model that I made up to see if it all worked. And of course it's domino together, but it's a bit rough. But then the that pops down there. I've got a, a stripping, I've got a, a very fine stripping which these little units clip into, which is from Hayfully. Um, but that's all good, I can show that later. But see, these are dominoed in. Now, the thing about these dominoes are, because it's only 12 millimeter board, you can't use any of the big dominoes. So you gotta use, you gotta use the little baby buns. There's a big, there's a big daddy one. You gotta use the little ones. And they're really small and they're really thin. And they're, I think they're, um, let me see here. They are 40 by 20 millimeters. I don't use them much. Um, haven't had a great deal but to use them for, but it's tricky, this one, because the regular, the paddles on, a, on the reference of your uh, uh, domino, so if we put them, say we want two of them, and I'm going to try and hold the camera so we're getting the best sort of view from the camera. And if we want them about here so we don't sort of go into that groove, that's probably about the, roughly about the best position they can go in. The paddles, and if I get one of the paddles off the um, domino, it stops at about the centre, so I'm only going to get one. Now, I guess I could probably get away with one. But it's not right in the center, which means it takes an inference from this side or this side, depending on how you, you're doing your dominoes, and it's always a bit tricky. But um, I've got, and I've had this for some time now, it's a, it's a unit from RTS Engineering, there you go, you can see it, plain as day. And um, this is a unit I bought from the States, and I know if I didn't buy it from the States, I apologise, I think I actually, no, I did buy this one from the States, but I do believe that you can buy them from... Uh, Festool, I think Festool even sell them now. And uh, what's good about them is, for these smaller jobs, you can set some extra paddles up. Because the beautiful thing about the uh, the big the big um, uh, 700 Domino is you've got you've got more paddles along the side. Um, I reckon my mate John could probably come up with some great little invention, but <laughs> that's another that's another day. But anyway, um, what I've done is I've said to myself that. Here you can see the markings, well, probably about there. I'm going to keep playing with the camera because it flares out. You can see the markings right in there and right in there. Now, if I want that's where my centre of my dowel, my domino is going to come down. Whoops, I'm trying to do this without all the special camera gear. Now, when this paddle comes down, I can set this paddle along here by locking in these two uh, screws. And therefore, I can set it for this side. And you flip that up, you flip this down, and I can set it for that side so that they're both in the center. Well, actually, it is the center, so it's a matter of how I've got the camera going. So these are great for like these smaller jobs. Well, they're great for you know a lot of jobs, but they're great for these smaller jobs where you just don't have the width in your paddle um, of your uh, domino to be able to do it. So um, yeah, they're quite a good little unit. Um, of course, like, like everything, they're not cheap. Um, I think they're a few hundred bucks, maybe two or three hundred bucks. I'm, I can't remember. I did have buy it a while ago. But there it is from RTS Engineering. Um, good. They help. I don't use it much, but it certainly does help. And by the way, oh, sorry, the other thing too is you just screw it on here and here in the same domino holes, which are actually in the domino plate, which is pretty standard sort of thing. And if I flip it over you actually will still use it like a, a normal domino but um, and you've got these extra ones on the outside and i believe you can actually even buy extra extra paddles if you want but uh, yeah i just sort of pass this on to everyone okay all right guys i've now got a i've only got a handful of these things to make <laughs> so uh, this will make life easy and i keep messing around with the the setting to try and get a better picture for you because these uh, LED lights, while well, they're fantastic, they kind of tend to flare out a little bit. Okay, have a nice day, guys. See ya.